Hey there, fellow gardeners, and welcome back to Growing with Glenna. Today, we are doing something a little bit unconventional. Most of the time, I move from hydroponics to soil. And today, we're going to be moving from soil back into hydroponics. Lettuce, especially varieties like Salanova oak leaf, doesn't thrive well above 70 degrees Fahrenheit. But I've got all these beautiful heads of lettuce, and I don't want them to go to waste. So I'm flipping the script and transplanting from soil to hydroponics. Here's the story of how all those heads of lettuce came into one tub and are now making their journey back inside. First off, I had some old lettuce seeds, red and green oak leaf varieties that just wouldn't germinate, no matter what I tried. And I did use the tried and true methods in this video. But there were a lot of seeds and there are a few things different so maybe just one more time with some Terra Hill Farm 2024 soil compost mix. It was March 3rd and I figured I'd have more time to plant something else if these didn't grow. So I decided to give those seeds one last chance. I tossed them all in and covered them lightly with compost. Two weeks later uh, to my surprise lettuce seedlings started popping up. And before I knew it, those seedlings had grown into small lettuce plants. A lot of small lettuce plants. If you've been watching the channel, you know I love fresh lettuce. And I believe in cut and come again. So I've been picking this lettuce every few days. But now it's, it's getting hotter and we're in Central Texas. Pretty soon it's going to be so hot that it will be above 70 degrees most of the time and that's not a healthy soil environment to grow lettuce. I'm going to be pulling some of these heads of lettuce so that they can go into the hydroponics indoors. What's the next best thing? Take it inside <laughs> where it's a little bit more climate controlled. Rinse off the soil gently. This was a part that I really was cautious about because I didn't want to break any of the leaves. And as you can see, I put them into net cups. If it needed to be supported by Lika, lightweight expanded clay aggregate, I did. I put them into the nutrient solution that was approximately 900 ppm. Here you're seeing a couple of the lettuce heads I transplanted about four days ago and one that has been cut and come again twice now <laughs> and is growing well. I just left it as an example of what you can grow and hydroponics from the beginning. Here they all are, ready to grow. Now, isn't this innovative? Who says you can't do things differently in the garden? Whether it's in hydroponics or in soil. If you're enjoying this unconventional gardening journey, then subscribe to the Growing with Glenna YouTube channel. Because you never know when we'll be in soil or if we'll be in hydroponics. And give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. And happy gardening.